A government program that's designed to make Canadian homes greener is about to end, but not without a fight. And we get more details in NewsHour Insight tonight with Deb Hope. Deb. Yes, thanks, Chris. The Eco Energy Program was established to give Canadian homeowners financial incentives in the form of rebates to help them make their homes more energy efficient. By all accounts, it's been a big success. The program expires at the end of this month, but a coalition of businesses and environmental groups is is making a last-ditch effort to save it. They say not only does it make environmental sense, it's good economics as well. The only way to know for sure how energy efficient your home is, is to test it. And that's exactly what home energy advisor Tim Schulz is doing at this 70-year-old Point Grey home today. So everywhere that we find movement of air, leakage is a place where heat can escape. Over the past four years, 700,000 Canadians have had their homes audited as part of a federal incentive program. Of those, 460,000 homeowners have made changes to their homes and qualified for government grants under the EcoEnergy Retrofit Program. Well, EcoEnergy is great for homeowners who are looking to save energy and to green their homes. And the program helps by providing homeowners with financial incentives and expert advice to help them make those choices. But last year, the Harper government announced the highly popular program will end this month. That set off a chain of events. And now a coalition of industry associates, environmental organizations and small businesses are urging the government to rethink its decision before next week's federal budget. It's an economic stimulus, it's an environmental benefit, it's a win-win-win. The, the federal government can stack the benefits up with this program like pancakes a mile high. Under the rebate program, participants have been replacing windows, doors, furnaces, you name it, saving over three tons of greenhouse gas emissions while cutting their energy costs on average by 21 percent. And according to the coalition, the grant program has stimulated the economy at no cost to the government. When you do the math, EcoEnergy actually puts money back in the government's pockets. The program actually generates $2 in tax revenue for every dollar it spends in homeowner incentives. If the program is axed, there will be a cost. As many as a thousand companies will be out of business and countless employees will be out of work, including Tim, who jokes he may have to wait on tables when he'd rather be calculating ways for homeowners to save money. And speaking of energy conservation,